Hey everybody, welcome to the Average Joe Movie Show. My name's Zach. I'm here with Brandon, Joe, and Jeremy. Joe. <laughs> it never gets yo, old. Yo, Joe. <laughs> it never gets old. And uh, this time we are going to talk about Chain Reaction. You may or may not have ever heard of this film. Because it was done in the 80s, wasn't it? Uh, no. It seemed 90s. like it. Early 90s. 90s. Early 90s. Yeah. 30 second rundown. Keanu Reeves uh, is a machinist. He's a machine. <laughs> He's a the robot. <laughs> <laughs> That's him being oh, a robot. You. That was on the dance. <laughs> it's just him trying to act, right? He's like... Keanu Reeves is a machinist, uh, and he is working at uh, Chicago University somewhere. They're working on cold fusion. And uh, he cracks he, it. He's a what? A machinist? Yeah, but okay. Good. Yeah. He and a group of scientists and everything, uh, the college professor and everything, they crack cold fusion. They're thrilled. They can't believe they've done it. Um, as soon as they crack it, uh, the lab is, <clears throat> excuse me, the lab is sabotaged. Big explosion. Big eight square block explosion gets leveled. Uh, Morgan Freeman is kind of the funding. He's he's kind of the capitalist in here. Uh, he kind of disappears. We don't know what happened to him. The main scientist is found strangled. So obviously there's foul play here. We don't know who or what. The FBI gets involved, and it looks like um, Keanu is being framed. Keanu and his... Uh, there's another scientist there that's being framed for this. So the the FBI is trying to track him down. Keanu is trying to clear his name and find out what's going on and uh, trying to decide who's his friend, who's his enemy. And that's it. That's the 30-second rundown of Chain Reaction. All in all, <clears throat> first of all, who's seen it? I have. You've seen it? I can't remember. You maybe have seen it. I knew who was in it. That was pretty good for me. Yeah. Uh, I have to say I saw the TV version, so I can't speak towards its cleanliness or not. It seemed good. It was PG-13, wasn't it? Well, I think so. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I mean, it was a... It was kind of like Jason Bourne back in the day. I think it was one of these films where when it came out, it was probably pretty cool, pretty action-packed and stuff. Keanu, Keanu has a hard time selling physical action you know he runs weird he has a hard time selling the <laughs> the acting he's a human <laughs> and not a cyborg yeah um I, I, it's rough I wanted to like it like enough so that we actually stopped it halfway through because it was getting late at night and I was excited to turn it back on again and finish it but I hate watching half a movie so take that for what it's worth um I don't know. I mean, there wasn't a lot of fake stuff in it. It wasn't like, oh, that's so fake. Well, I guess, yeah, he's always dodging bullets and, like, he outsmarts the FBI. Just yeah, by... Keanu Reeves outsmarting somebody. Yeah. I, it, was, it was, it was a spoiler alert, it was weird seeing Morgan Freeman as a bad guy. Kind of the bad guy. He's a good bad guy, though. He's a good bad because guy. Because you don't think he's going to be bad. He's a good actor. Yeah. And he gets away at the end. That's what's weird, too. Mm. That's a big spoiler. That's yeah, like sorry. the spoiler of all spoilers. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> sorry about that. <laughs> if you haven't seen it, though. Yeah. It's 20 years old. <laughs> Seriously. This was back when Keanu Reeves was trying to make action movies. This was back with Johnny Newman. Pre Speed? Pre Speed. Is this Pre Speed? I think pre-speed? so. Maybe not. I don't know, around that time, though. Yeah, go Do for I pre- look at You got, got, like got pre- your Speed, Johnny Mnemonic, you got. This I forgot about Johnny Mnemonic. Yeah. My friend would call it Johnny Mnemonic. Because <laughs> he had a Because there's element? an M on oh, Mnemonic, oh. and so he was sounding it out. That was funny friend. He did it on purpose no, or on no, okay. No, he just didn't quite get it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm, I mean, I'm even looking for tangents to go on on this movie. I, to me, it was just one of those that they make really quick, try to make an action movie and try to sell it with having Morgan Freeman and Keanu Reeves in it. Yeah, try to make money that way. He was big at the time. I mean, they, he, yeah, they they are and were-ish, I guess. But 
Yeah, I didn't think that it was too entertaining. Yeah. I mean, there was action in it, but I don't remember getting... Getting into it? Into it, yeah. Getting invested in the action. I'm like, I wonder what's going to happen. Oh, so yes. Speed was 94 and Chain Reaction was 96. Oh, bummer. When was Johnny... Johnny may not my knob Let me see if I can... While you're looking that up, I will say, I think I was into it not for the action, but to try to figure out if Morgan Freeman was a bad guy or not. Yeah. And, you know, who's... What's going to happen? And there are a couple, there are a couple twists and turns in it. Uh, he instantly becomes an expert, uh, like, hydrofoil driver, which is kind of cool. Chicago. Nice. Yeah. Anything else? No. I mean, I'd say... Would you, yeah, would you see it? On TV. You know, I'd watch it just because it's something to watch. And there is some action. You know, if you don't care about good acting or anything, then sure. Why not? Yeah. Uh, Johnny Mnemonic Neuma- is uh, 1995. Wow. He was busy. Yeah. He did a lot of stuff, right? And that was all that was when he, he kinda was He kind of had his window. He, yeah. knew, he knew when the iron was hot. Yeah. I mean, since you haven't seen it, I'll just go ahead and wrap it up and say uh, the movie was, I would say, completely lukewarm. Wasn't, wasn't awesome, but wasn't dumb. Saturday afternoon, flip it on, watch it. Or flip it off because it's that bad. <laughs> Whoa. That could be taken any way you want. <laughs> okay. Uh, special thanks to our sponsors, the FSA Stock Exchange. Uh, find us on YouTube. Find us on Facebook. And hey, a special shout out to uh, Casey is the bomb. <laughs> Casey, you are the bomb. <laughs> thanks for leaving your comments. We enjoy your constructive criticism. It makes us better. <laughs>